Hi, this is Dr. Gary. Welcome to the Daily Tune-Up today. If you're in a relationship and sometimes it seems like that relationship isn't working, maybe you feel like that person that you're in the relationship with doesn't get who you are, or maybe they do things that irritate you, that's going to happen in all of our relationships. Always remember, I, I like this little saying that says, familiarity breeds contempt. Well, that's really more true in relationships than anywhere. Because you're with that person probably more than you are anyone else, so you're going to start seeing the cracks in the pavement probably more than you do a lot of other people. It's always good to romanticize about a relationship with someone else because it's always new and fresh and you haven't seen the cracks in the pavement. What you overlook, though, is the seasoning that goes on in a relationship. In our relationships, many times, we're learning and growing, especially the more problems it seems like we're having. And as we're growing through this relationship, we're learning a lot about ourselves, and at the same time, we learn a lot of things we don't like about that other person. It doesn't mean that relationship can't work. It just means we have to really, really take a look at what we're learning and growing with. Now, I agree some relationships probably are happening, and they ought not to be happening. And we probably, probably could not be in that relationship if we really took a look at the reality of it. But many relationships, we look at failures, they really can be successes if we just take responsibility for our stuff. Remember, in a relationship, you have to realize you're 50% of it, and that other person is also 50% of it. You have nothing to do with that other person's 50%, only yours. And many times if you can change what you're doing in a relationship, it's going to have an amazing effect on that other person. You see, anytime you're 50% of the effect of anything, it's going to have a huge effect on the whole. So in your relationships, always understand, rather than look at what's not working, the more stress you're under, the more frustration you're under, probably means you're learning something. This is good. Comfort is something we all seek. We all want to be comfortable. We all want to be happy. And a lot of times we blame our relationships for our unhappiness. And really the unhappiness lies within ourself in the way we're looking at things in our life. And many times it has nothing to do with that relationship itself. However, we blame it on the relationship because we haven't finished our business inside, maybe with a past relationship. I can also guarantee you if you leave a relationship and you haven't dealt with that stuff inside of you and you carry it on to another relationship blaming the one you're in now, you're going to have the same problem. So the true message today in our tune-up is we have to take a look at the 50% of the responsibility we have in our relationships with anyone and understand we have a huge effect on create, creating and also correcting anything that's not going well. And one of the greatest things we can do in a relationship is to really push that communication to the limit by asking questions and also really getting to know what that other person's dreams, desires, and wants are as well and what you can do to help facilitate that. And they have to do the same with you. Just a footnote, this week is going to be the last week of my live tune-ups for a little while. Tomorrow's going to be the last tune-up I'm going to do. However, the archives are available with almost 600 of these tune-ups available to you and anyone you want to watch them on various subjects. I reviewed these subjects and I can't believe all the things we've talked about and most of the stuff was brought on by emails and messages I've got from all of you. I appreciate the response you give me on these tune-ups. Also, we're going to go off the air with these live, but they're going to be there in the archives. You're not going to be receiving one every day like you have been. However, keep yourself on the mailing list because this fall, we're revamping everything on DGTV. We're going to have a new look, a whole new way of doing business, and I look forward to you being part of that. So be patient with us as we go through this transition phase. I'm going to take a little bit of time off and regroup myself. I appreciate your help, your support. And I really appreciate the feedback you've given me on these tune-ups. www.dgtvchannel.com is the website where all of these tune-ups are nested just for you and your friends. So until tomorrow, which will be the final tune-up for a little while, this is Dr. Gary wishing you to work on those relationships. And in doing that, have a great day. Bye-bye.